Hello and welcome to more Sonic Heroes! We are going right back in with Team Dark to where we left off with this giant eagle airplane helicopter thing. So you're the ones who are playing games with my army. Primary target detected. Destroy Dr. Eggman. You must only <laughs> Is that any way to treat your creator? Now with this your master's real power. The Egg Hawk! Oh man, I guess this is our first boss fight. So we'll have to figure out how to do this. I've never fought a boss in Sonic Heroes before, so I guess you guys are going to be learning with me. I might need to use different characters, but for now it looks like I just got to use some speed to catch up with them and actually hit them. Looks like I got to hit these little wings on the side. I can see the health bar on the right there. Oh, we got enemies too, though. Let's go back to some power form. We're not back to. Let's just go straight up to some power form here. Rotary attack. Oh, crud. I think I've got to jump over those things. Let's see if I can jump up and then do some down attacks to hit him. Oh, yeah, that's working. That's working. Looks like he's going to take 100 uh, damage to kill, though. But these do three damage each time. Oh, but he's got spikes. Got to watch out for that. Let's get Rouge out to take down these flying enemies. Yeah, there we go. Knock him out the sky, then go in and homing attack him. Nice. Let's go chase this fool down. Wait. Oh, he's coming back. He's coming back. He wants some more. Come on, Rouge. Get these last ones taken care of. Oh, 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 there we go. All right. Come here, Scrub. I'll chase you down. What's this tutorial say? I am trying to knock out the rotors, dude. Give me some time. Oh, I thought that was an enemy. That's just that's just Omega. Stay calm. Dodge the bullets. Treat the lasers, yo. What if I press B? Can I go faster? There we go. That's going to catch me up. Okay. Here we go. Oh! Oh man, I suck at this crud. Let me get some ring, get a ring, get a ring, got it. Okay, just keep hitting him. There we go, got one of them taken out. I guess I was not hitting the rotary, I was hitting the, the center parts. Let's get out those uh, rotaries here. Get the second one. Unless that one's taken care of. Maybe they share a health bar, I don't know. This part's down to 50, we only have one ring. Before I move on, I'm actually going to get this level up for Rouge, and then I'm going to get some more rings here. Get this. Good. Give me these rings, just for safety purposes. Let's go chase him down. We can leave those enemies behind, no big deal. Let's go, come on, speed up. I'm just gonna keep going all the way to the next battlefield, I guess. Might as well. All right, back to power stand. No, we're still chasing him for some reason. Why is he not stopping? Oh, uh, level up for Omega, that's good. I don't exactly know if I'm supposed to just keep going and hope that he stops eventually. I'm just gonna mash B here. Oh, let's take out these enemies. Yeah, if I could stop losing my rings, that would be great. Oh, the rotary attack keeps getting me, dude. All right, get the rings. Got them. Let's go get this. Okay, now we're doing damage. We're doing like six damage per hit now because I leveled up. Okay, there's 33 left. Okay, 21. Come on. Wait. Oh, Shadow got hurt, so I can't throw him right now. All right, let's take these guys out just to get some more level ups. Oh, no. Don't miss. Okay, good. Let me go take out the other side. Oh, you're coming back for more. Yes, I actually got him. Dude, just a couple more hits and he'll be dead. Come back, bro. Okay, let me kill these guys. Try to get up to level three. Not quite enough, but I'm getting pretty close. I bet you after I kill these, I will get it. And still not quite, but I I don't really know how that level up system works. Someone said it was kill five enemies, but I could have swore I killed five there. What? We got him. All right. And what kind of score do we get? I tried to take out some enemies, get some rings to get a better score, but I did take quite a while on that one. It took me three minutes and 12 seconds. D rank, darn it, man. I am really bad at this crud. Oh well. I tried, guys. We're up to four emblems here. Nice! And I guess we're saving. Do we have any cutscene or just get dropped right into the next stage? All right, we're going to get dropped into Grand Metropolis, which I will do on the next episode. But this episode is not over. I'm actually going to cut over to Team Rose. So, oh, we got cutscenes. Hold up. Behind all of this. Whatever it takes, he's mine. Any objections? Negative. Is this the energy plant? That red liquid is being traded at high prices. Eggman must have plans to control the energy. All right, so there was a little bit of a cutscene there, but like I was saying, I'm going to cut over to Team Rose. And the reason for that is, first of all, I said I am going to play through with all the teams to get the final boss. 
And with Team Rose, I'm gonna show me getting the Chaos Emerald that I missed with uh, this playthrough here. So I'll meet you guys right there. I just wanted to show off a couple of things real quick with Team Rose. It turns out that there's actually a couple of different attacks. So here is the Jump B attack with Rose, or uh, Amy actually. She just does this crud, look at that. She has like a hammer thing. Also, instead of starting directly in Act 1 of that one stage, it turns out it just throws us into a tutorial, so that's kind of interesting. So there you go. Also, if you hover with this team, Big will just pull out an umbrella instead of them like all grouping up into a skydive formation. And of course, the most important thing. Ah, yeah. What the crud was that? And here is Team Rose's Team Blast. Holy crud. Like the crud, I got a rank A on this one. This team is so easy. And here we are about to make it to the end. I have the key and let's see what it does. We did it. So I guess we're gonna get a bonus stage which might lead to a Chaos Emerald. That's what people are telling me. So let's find out. I have to say, I mean, Team Dark is not that hard, but this crud is like really easy. So if you just want to go through the game, I would recommend this team for sure. We got another A rank, just like that. And we also have Big the Cat, and he's amazing, so... That, I think this is my favorite team just because of Big, but it's okay guys, I'll, I'll play Team Dark, it's fine. Don't even worry about it. So, let's go to the special stage, Act 1, Emerald Challenge. I have no idea what to expect here. Oh, do I have to go fast? How to use the power dash. All right, let's go, let's go. Just gotta chase it down, get it, get to it before it gets to the end. I think I can do this, I'll just keep mashing B. I think this is the fastest way to move. I see it. I don't know if mashing B or holding B is the fastest way to go. Let's go through the balls, come on. Gotta catch it. Gotta catch the ball just like the Pokemans. Just like the Pokemans, Amy. Channel your inner Pokemon. Holy crud, am I even catching up to it? Oh man, I'm missing all the balls. Crud. Let me try holding it instead. There we go. We're getting there. We're getting there. We got it! Yes! That was actually not that bad at all. Alright! But we did it, guys! Mission clear! So we've now gotten the first Chaos Emerald. I'm not sure if this Chaos Emerald will carry over into the Team Dark playthrough. Let me know, guys. I'm not sure if I have to do all of them for every team or just for one team. Let me know on that. If I have to get it for Team Dark as well, I'll go back and do that. I'll probably do that not on the... Not on the Let's Play, but just on my own time. So let me know these details, and I guess I will see you guys in the next episode. Take care.